stuffing, everyone. We in Costco. <laughs> it's more fun than a big group. <laughs> Except we didn't know where to find you, and I kept stopping and I kept saying, keep going. Our neighbor walked in the exit door. <laughs> so, we had to walk through like this maze of like wooden pallets to get into the store. I'll show you all when we leave the maze that we had to walk through. Okay. My YouTube channel is dead right now, so I got to vlog the shopping. I haven't been out. I'm leading the way. So, if I'm in cosplay, I'm going to vlog. Here is banana. I mean, here, here's apples. We in the fruit section. Apocalypse shopping, everyone. Yeah. Did you take a picture of him? Kathy over there. Yes, I took a picture. Okay. You want a picture? We have to wait by these markers on the floor. There's markers everywhere on the floor that's six feet apart. <laughs> so if we're waiting in our group, we have to wait by these six foot markers. Well, not in our group because we're all- I know, but for like everyone else, they have to stay at a different marker. Okay, where are we? Let's go to the, the deli. Uh, go and get some meat. The deli thing here. Yep. The shark needs meat. Here. This vlog's gonna be boring, but my channel is dead. So you get what you get. It's quarantine time. <laughs> At the deli here. They're out of bowls, apparently. Are those bowls? No, they're plates. <laughs> I wasn't. Oh, are, are these bowls? Where? These are bowls. Oh. Is it a big package of bowls? Yeah, that's them. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I found the bowls. Yeah, they Thank you. Yeah. Good thing you came along. <laughs> I found the bowls. We're out of the uh, fresh food and now I'm finally warm. It's freezing. Warm. I was freezing. <laughs> Paper towels. I'm in looking short sleeves. I'm freezing. The elastic keeps hurting my ear. Okay, yeah. These are really pretty tops. <laughs> okay, y'all, I know I'm short. But that's a lot of stuff. I feel extra short in here. You know, I feel like we're on a scavenger hunt. We're on a scavenger hunt, apparently. They used to be back in the corner with the toilet paper, but they've moved up. My nose keeps running in here, but I don't have, you know, what is the it? epidemic. What's I just have here? allergies. Wow, I'm so tired. Soda? I'm just Everybody staring into space. I'm gonna go there then. I do. Okay. Got some shirts. We have to find peanut butter too. Got this one with a truck. And then I got two button down shirts because manly so why not I like the truck shirt this is the back and then the front I can't open it straight this is the front we're gonna go on straight down this there's nuts well all I see is nuts yeah, all I see is nuts. Sure don't want some nuts. And coffee. You need coffee? That was a bit of a traffic jam. We're all supposed to be six feet apart. You said he makes really good coffee. Oreos. What? Oreos. Oreos. Hashtag not sponsored. You may have to pay for the bill. <laughs> Where's cereal? Why is medication so expensive? $35. I told her for to ask this. for a prescription for it. It'll be cheaper. $5 for four. Yeah, I know. But I needed it yes the other day and I don't have my inhaler still. Is which contact me? Yeah. Oh, wow. She's got I have red. red <laughs> I have red contacts in, by the way. And my eyebrows are red. I see. <laughs> I'm Kirishima. So, I am Kirishima. Yeah. 
No one recognized them. Ejiro Kirishima. So, I wonder if they have a less fun stuff. He's so. going to his party party. <laughs> That's on the vlog now. So, oh. <laughs> That's so, what the um, video used to have. have That's like on the vlog check. now. Do you have a credit card? <laughs> This is the maze we had to walk through to get into Costco. We had to walk through that maze. Store one complete. Jonathan's items are there. Ours are in the trunk. I feel like I'm dying because all I had today was a sandwich. And I'm hungry. I want to eat the food. Okay, what are we going for? Jonathan needs toilet paper. We need paper towels. Medication. You need medication. If I give you money, can you just run in and get your medication and paper towels? Mm -hmm. I see the lady with the cart. She could see I was packing up. Can you just go through? I'd like to go to walkway. And? <laughs> Where's our cop? Um, we went through the walkway. <laughs> That's because you know. your mother has no patience. Oh crap, we're stuck. <laughs> oh no, you could go that way. <laughs> It's like a damn puzzle in here. It's like a maze, <laughs> like we had to walk through with the pallets. Yeah, People know. without masks are putting the rest of us in danger. So okay. the thing with the masks is, if the masks help keep everything that we have in with us. It doesn't help us from anyone else's germs. Well, I gotta put mine back on. Especially, especially if people aren't wearing their masks, okay, wait, I gotta sit then there. they're putting us all in danger. I wanna I'm sit going because I wanna it. do this. Hmm? All right, we finished our shopping. But it was so. it was fun all together, though, really, it totally <laughs> was. I did not yeah. have a panic attack in there. It was my first time quarantine shopping. Yeah, did you like it? It was interesting. <laughs> it's not fun to do it by yourself. It looks like a war zone to me. Yeah, it was interesting. There was places you could you could um, walk, and then there was places you couldn't walk. And we That's had to walk new. through a maze. This morning, that was not there. We had to walk through a maze. Okay, now we gotta drag um, all this in. One guy on. said I was a troll doll. <laughs> Where? At Costco? I didn't hear anybody say you were a troll doll. Yeah, he's just like, I like your hair, it's cool. It reminds me of those troll dolls. I'm like, <laughs> uh, thanks, it's anime. I did hear some man say he liked your hair and he thought it was, and you said it's a wig and then I didn't hear him say troll Yeah, doll. he said it reminded me of the troll Okay, okay. Okay, here's a picture of a troll doll next to me. Kirishima is now this. <laughs> I like troll dolls. They're very cute. I have a collection of troll dolls. So yeah, we home and I gotta uh, help carry we gotta legit carry everything in. And then I'm gonna eat stuff because I'm hungry. I wanna wash my hands. I had a snack. Okay, now I did get you some TV dinners, but you got plenty mm -hmm. for dinner because we are gonna get okay. continental. Yeah, okay, Ooh, everyone. Guess what? Guess what? Let hold me on. The vlog. Wait, everyone watching? Stop eating out because it puts you and the workers both <laughs> at risk because you have to leave the house. Steve and Kathy are here to help us carry. Uh-huh. So stop eating out. I am not happy that you guys are eating out. Yes, well. So it you... puts the workers at risk. If everyone would just stay home unless they're the grocery workers, shopping. The workers want you to so they can make money. The corporate wants you to because they want money. Not Continental. They're family owned. They can close it anytime they want. Yeah. Okay. The corporate wants money. Okay, let's roll. Stop eating out. Okay, I would just like to explain what was happening in the car right before I was just like, okay, bye. And like explain my views a little bit more without my mom trying to scream over me. So going out to the grocery store is essential and the workers in the grocery store are essential because we have to get food so that we can you know not starve and water and toiletries and all that stuff why i'm mad is my mom will not stop going out to get fast food just like mcdonald's and subs and pizza and like frappuccinos and all this other stuff that is non-essential when we just went to the grocery store literally a half an hour ago and got food <laughs> my stance on this is is the grocery stores are essential but fast food chains are non-essential and it's putting all the workers in that fast food chain at risk for you know getting sick 
because they have to work in close quarters in the kitchen. They can't social distance in there. They have to go out of their house more than they should be going out of their house. And it's just not good. Uh, the point for flattening the curve is getting as many people as possible out of the public and at home in self-quarantine. And when you have this, the fast food workers who have to go out to work, and then you have people who are going out to buy said fast food, then it's not going to help. And we're not getting out of quarantine. My state has not hit its peak yet. And we're in the middle of May. Which means we're going to be stuck through summer. Because people are not quarantining. And it's really pissing me off. Can everyone please just stay home, you know, unless they have to go out for work or groceries? You know, just the faster you do it, the faster we're going to get out of quarantine and end this, you know? And you're putting people at risk. Like, I am at risk because I have asthma. My mom's at risk because she's over 60. Both of, like, her friends are at risk and, you know, our neighbors at risk who went to the store with us because they're over 60. And my mom is inviting them inside our home to eat the non-essential fast food and putting us further at risk because they're entering our home. <laughs> it's just, it's not cool. So, please, everyone, stay home. Don't have your friends over. If you're gonna go out and exercise at the park, that is, it's at risk, but at least you can social distance out in the middle of the park and wear your mask. Wear your mask. Um, so I just kind of wanted to explain a little bit more on my stance of that, you know. Especially when we just went grocery shopping. She should not be eating fast food right now. And I'm gonna go film TikToks because I am in happy sunshine boy kirishima and i'm not happy so we're gonna we're gonna just try and calm down bye well this should be fun also if anyone has like seen my past vlogs uh well the list was bad there but if you can tell i am actually enunciating a lot better now Let's try this. <laughs> this was a bad idea. <laughs> Well, I didn't choke.